Hey guys, today we are doing an unboxing of my haul from above ground, I believe that's what it's called. So, um, yeah, I think I got this like a couple days ago, but I ordered it like the beginning of the month, maybe. Yeah. Um, so basically I've been making a lot of Animal Crossing themed jewelry boxes. Because I have nothing better to do. And I think I have more than enough to actually start up a shop right now. So that's pretty exciting. Oh, hold on. I don't think you can see my address. Ow. Okay. Uh, uh, yeah, that didn't happen. <laughs> To act as cushion, I guess. And nothing breaks. Oh, this is way smaller than I thought it would be. Okay. Well, anyways, we have some gold acrylic. Kind of forgot I bought gold because I have a very, very tiny bottle of gold paint this was 22 dollars 25 ish with tax this was only like 15 <laughs> 15 and it's like look at the size but like this i think this gold is better this one's more light like more sandy i guess but yeah we have amsterdam this is called light gold. This is how they do it, right? <laughs> and like, I don't know. Um, I guess it's packaged really well since they also tape the lid so it doesn't like spill or anything because that would be not good. And we have brown. This is way smaller than I thought. But we have some brown acrylic paint. It is called Burnt Sienna. Also taped at the bottom for security. Um, we have the basic colors. So we have titanium white, cadmium yellow, deep you. What? Uh, Cadmium orange hue, cadmium red medium hue, permanent green, primary blue, deep violet, and Mars black. Here it is. Oh boy. I think this was like $25. Because my package came to $57. Uh, my last package is this. It is sculpt air dry clay. I'm planning on making coasters. And then I guess with the leftover I might make some like Animal Crossing themed or something. I've been seeing on like YouTube people are making like uh, the Animal Crossing trees with clay. So But I don't know how it's gonna work because this is heavy. But yeah. I'm very excited to do this. I haven't dealt with clay in a very long time. It is very heavy. It's one kilogram. Okay. And now we just have an empty box. Which has my address. So basically this is what I've been working on. This one is undone. I'm planning on redoing the top. Because I don't like it. I hate it. But yeah. This is the sides. It's just based on his shirt since he, well no, this is based on his shirt, but the bottom is just because he is a octopus, I think octopus, and 
you know, the ocean. So we got the waves going. And this is the inside. It should be able to hold rings. So, yes. And then we have stitches. He's so cute. Oh my god. So I based all sides of the boxes based on like the colors of him, but like pastel. So here is the front sides. It's so cute. I love it. And then inside, it's like the other. But you just put it in. Could be a ring. I guess you could put earrings, but you do. do. Then we have Gaston, I think. This is Gaston. I don't really like this one, but this is Gaston. Nothing really different with his shirt or the sides. It's just like pastel version of his shirt. And the inside is also the same. Then we have Roald. Oh my god, he's so cute. He's like, it's like that picture of the meme where he's just sitting. And then he has like the orange on top of his head. And I love that so much. But this is Roald. It was, uh, the background supposed to be his flannel shirt. Because that's what he wears. And yeah. So cute. There's nothing really exciting about the sides, but yeah. And then this is the inside. They're all pretty much the same. Then this is the last box that I have done. This is the Celeste one. I kind of like it, but I hate it at the same time because when I was doing it, I never noticed that it was like off center. So. It looks nice, and then I realize that it's off center. <laughs> so, yeah. But I like it. I even use gold to paint at the back. This is the inside. Yeah, nothing really special about these. Uh, and then I'm currently working on Filbert. I have been postponing it because I've been waiting for my paint to come in, but they're finally in, so yeah. I might be doing a live stream of me painting it, so that's going to be exciting, maybe. I don't know if it's going to be on Twitch or on YouTube, but yeah. But um, I have I made a TikTok because of Fatima, but um, on my TikTok I made like a video on how I created the boxes so it's just like cutscenes of me painting and taping and whatever so maybe I'll post that I don't know but yeah you should follow my tiktok nothing exciting happens there it's why yeats I think same as my instagram it could be wrong it might be any yeats I'm not sure but yeah these are my boxes I'm kind of glad we're happy the way they uh, came out, but I don't know, the black, like I waited for it to dry, but when I put the varnish on, which is this, I did not realize how thin this was, so I have way too much. Hopefully it does not dry out, but uh, I didn't realize that it like smudged the back. So yeah, sorry if I keep moving the camera, but yeah, excited for that. So I guess I'll be opening up a Etsy shop and figuring it out from there. Don't know what I'm doing. But yeah. Yeah. Thank you for watching my video. Um, please subscribe and follow me and turn on that notification and um, stay safe. Thank you for all the essential workers and for risking your lives and just being you and yeah. oh this is my shirt it's so cute but yeah thank you please share this on tumblr on twitter on myspace on aim on msn all those kind of good stuff what was that
Okay, that might have been my hair. <laughs> okay, thank you. Bye, guys.